NASA sending people back to the moon could depend on the Starship rocket. That's the SpaceX rocket that's going to take astronauts to the lunar surface. But Starship's only flown four tests, which went something like this. Boom, boom, made it to space, boom, made it to space, made it back. Whew. That was a huge milestone. But to be ready for NASA's moon landing mission, Artemis 3, Starship has to prove a lot more. During the mission, SpaceX will have to launch one Starship rocket into orbit, then launch somewhere between four and 20 more rockets to catch up with the first one and transfer fuel onto it. Only then will that one rocket be able to take astronauts to the moon and back. So at the top of Starship's to-do list is a test flight that transfers fuel between rockets. If it can do that by early next year, then Artemis 3 could at least possibly stay on track for September 2026. But there'll be other tests too, and Starship's already been delayed a lot. Plus, there have been issues with the Artemis mission spacesuits and its other spacecraft that will all have to be solved in time. If not, the moon landing might not happen before 2027 and could even get pushed past 2030. But when it does lift off, Artemis 3 and Starship will ring in a new era in space exploration.